Spring Hill Elementary School opened in 1965. The school and Spring Hill Road take their name from a farm established by the Swink family in the early 1800s. Johann Wilhelm Schwenk, a blacksmith, was born in Pennsylvania in 1742. Around 1770, he moved to Prince George's County, Maryland and changed his name to William Swink. Approximately 10 years later, Swink relocated his growing family to Fairfax County, Virginia, where he purchased 21 acres of land northeast of present-day Spring Hill Elementary School. The first Swink family home here was named Maidley. In 1808, Swink purchased 163 and a half acres from Robert and Elizabeth Rankin, considerably enlarging the size of his property. After William Swink and his wife Mary had passed away in the early 1820s, an inventory and appraisal of their real and personal property was conducted. From these records, we know that William and Mary Swink were slaveholders, that they raised horses, cattle, and sheep, and that their farm produced corn, oats, rye, and apple cider. William and Mary's farm passed to their youngest son, William Swink Jr., who built a new house and gave it a new name, Spring Hill. William Swink Jr. had served as a private in the Virginia militia during the War of 1812. Sometime prior to 1828, he married Margaret Lindsay, daughter of Thomas Lindsay of Mount Pleasant, and the couple had three daughters, Mary, Martha, and Anne. William and Margaret Swink's home sat on a hilltop overlooking a creek we now call Bull Neck Stream but during the Swink's time, it was known simply as Spring Branch. It is likely this setting inspired the name Spring Hill for the Swink's home and farm. At its height in the late 1840s, Spring Hill Farm encompassed some 350 acres. In 1869, the Swink's sold Spring Hill to Daniel Wells Alvord, a native of Massachusetts. Alvord died two years later, and his son, Henry Elijah Alvord, purchased the property. Henry Alvord had married William Swink's daughter, Martha, in 1866. The young couple are believed to have met during the American Civil War when Henry's regiment, the 2nd Massachusetts Cavalry, was stationed in Fairfax County. During his ownership of Spring Hill, Alvord transformed the property into a dairy farm. After Henry and Martha's deaths in the early part of the 20th century, the Spring Hill property was divided and sold several times by a succession of owners. The Spring Hill house was torn down in February 2014. Long before the construction of Spring Hill Elementary School, the children living in the vicinity of Spring Hill Farm were served by two different public schools. Very close to present day Spring Hill Elementary School, at the intersection of Spring Hill Road and Lewinsville Road, is the site of one of these early schoolhouses. It was known as the Odricks Corner School, after local landowner Alfred Odrick, a former slave and carpenter. From 1870 to 1965, public schools in Fairfax County were segregated by race. The Odricks Corner School, established around 1872, educated African American children. Pictured here in 1942 is the yellow-painted one-room Odricks Schoolhouse that was constructed in 1909. It was replaced in 1944 by a two-room school located on the site of present-day Charity Baptist Church. The enlarged schoolhouse made of brick closed in 1953 and the children were transferred to Louise Archer Elementary School in Vienna. On the opposite end of Spring Hill Road, at its intersection with Georgetown Pike, stood the Carper School, incorrectly identified on this 1912 map as the Casper School. A one-room schoolhouse for white children, Carper operated from around 1883 to 1925. After it closed, the students were transferred to the Franklin Sherman School in McLean. The Carper School was sold and converted into a dwelling. The structure was demolished in 1964 as part of a training exercise by the Great Falls Fire Department. Spring Hill Elementary School carries on the legacy of educational excellence of these early public schools, as well as preserving the memory of its namesake, Spring Hill Farm.